So they are not actually prisoners, they are just detainees. This is another young man who got arrested, we call him the error. No investigation. There is a detention. That's not called justice, it's called injustice. There's a minister of justice, maybe there's a minister of injustice. I'm serious. Maybe you are deputy director general of some of this. I don't want to make this a story tale. I would like this to be taken serious. Madam Marsha, chairman of that We do not go for people who we don't like. No. They offended us sometime now. No, I hope you went to a local university like me. There are issues that take place in our time in that university. Issues, serious issues. There are several of us there who got some of us in trouble. Most of you don't know I got in trouble with the student. But for the course, because some of you think we just started politics from long ago, we are politics as students. Politicians and students. We just said, no, first let's finish school. Next we said, no, first let's wait for the party and get the party okay. Then we are back to our new. Really? People used to report us, those days we used to have them. SPs used to call them. They would report you wrongly. But with technology now, digital, everything, we must be able to be on top of what we are investigating and nothing to do with our whole life and what may have happened between us and some of those in society because when we were young something happened. I think that's called professionalism. We conduct ourselves professionally. But the flip side of that is we will also not fail to prosecute someone because we are friends. Equal. Again, it's called professionalism. It's what it's called. Eventually, it leads to bans, equitous treatment, it leads to restoring the world. It's too much corruption going on. And why should you take someone to court and your witnesses are not ready? Why should you choose 20 witnesses? I'm, I'm following justice. I mean, I didn't say the student myself. I thought, why would you call 20 witnesses on one case? You are really confusing the judge. This is my personal opinion. I'm not influencing the judge. In these 15 times I was arrested, I was taken to court sometimes. And I used to tell, ask my lawyers, please, don't put six witnesses, just put three witnesses. That's enough. Material witnesses. Why do you put 20 witnesses and the, the cases here, the witness submission, actually, witness submission, submission, actually, 20 witnesses. That would be equivalent to 20 court days. If not one witness may run the whole court session, it means we are not ready for that case. When we are ready for the case, two, three key witnesses, hmm? I'm not just you, we're the last, I'm, 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 I'm the lawyers. But really, what is the offense? What law has been offended? Who is the witness? Who are the witnesses? Lastly, what's the case for? Any similar cases? You are done. So that, whatever I said, we must prosecute people within a short period of time. Justice delayed and justice denied. But also, when you over the delay the process, you even lose the test of the case. And eventually, the citizen loses. When the state loses, it means the citizen is lost, isn't it? Corruption is taken away too 
the two please said I was going away from you said that's the only reason why said to the best of our things families please support us support them everyone needs support everyone support us where can I please support the students their success is our success